Mm. He's on the loose again. Ugh. What is it with gods causing more problems than they solve? Is something the matter, master? Ah, Lord Tepes. Uh, I think I might have started a grudge match with that Arjuna altar. Hmm. You did mention having to use more saint quartz than usual. He has returned then? Yep. I'm gonna have to smack him down again. <sighs> Problem is, he's accompanied by that caster of Limbo. He's an alter ego, so I can't send the foreigners headlong into the fight unless he's out of the way. Excuse me, I couldn't help but overhear, but I believe I have a solution, Master. Ah, oh, Lord Caesar. What do you propose, then? Simply put, a squad of knight-class servants to deal with the alter ego, and perhaps chip away at the main quarry before sending in the big guns. Hmm. That could be viable. Foreigners can do that second part, but the question would be who could pull off the first part. Tesla is still recovering from that one incident with Lobo. I will go. Uh, are you sure about this, Lord Vlad? Alter ego or not, that caster of limbo is a depraved degenerate. It is both my duty and desire to see such a heathen punished. Personally. Uh, given I propose this idea, I should probably step up to the plate and join the fray as well. Uh, well, in that case... I have three foreigners to work with. Abby, the new kid Voyager, and mysterious heroine Double X. That just leaves one <laughs> Son of a mother! That is for calling me a pervert. Just because I kissed <coughs> Penthesilia's abs and muscular back does not mean I'm a fetishist. You do it on a regular basis! That's the textbook definition of a fetishist! Hey, Muscle Girls, Waifu, is a religion now, and I am a preacher. Penthe, Pargast, and Ketz's bodies are a gospel of strength and sex appeal. Besides, don't you like it when your girls are pale and bloodthirsty? And allergic to sunlight? <clears throat> Carmilla is not allergic to sunlight. I know because I've ridden in her convertible back in Vegas. <sighs> anyway, this is actually perfect timing. Oi, Ibaraki. You in the mood to kick some ass? Sure! Master offered me some snacks if I win. I don't like flesh and blood as much as Shutan does. Motivated by a sweet tooth now, huh? I guess they can know what to get you from Archer and Tomcat when we're done. Here, a red bean bun as payment in advance. I can get you the rest after the mission. Yee, let's go! And speaking of buns, I'm about to put one in Penthesilia's oven tonight. Y you, uh... <clears throat> You do that. Dude, Noriko is thick enough to pass for a MILF. You ain't got no room to talk. Also, <coughs> nutshot for good luck. <coughs> See you, Baraki. What part of that is good luck? You again. Uh, why must you torment me so, man of silver? Hey. Not even gods are above reproach or criticism. You cause trouble no matter who you are, you gotta deal with the consequences. You do realize I am not just any god. <laughs> do I use you, mortal? Oh, <laughs> not you yourself. You're as boring as cabbage soup. No, it's the realization that for such an all-powerful deity, not only did you merely reach the station by absorbing all the others in your but even then, your jurisdiction is surprisingly, horribly, limited. You mock me at your peril, assassin. I possess the powers of Vishnu and Brahma, the 
power to destroy and rebuild the entire universe as I see fit. There is no king nor emperor who would not fear such a being. Really? Interesting that you say that, because I happen to have a king and an emperor with me at the moment, and, uh, let's just say they disagree with you. Okay, now you're just being a pedantic little pissant. And how does it feel, having so much trouble that a pedantic little pissant, that your feuds with Karna pale in comparison? Oh. And... There it is. You just had to go there, didn't you? You set yourself up for that one, dumbass. Um, Master? Don't worry, Lord Caesar. Part of the plan. On second thoughts, no. I will not stoop myself to your level. I will not rise to your provocations, even if you invoke Karna's name. Good, because you'd still be too short even if you did. Okay, you know what? Fuck this. Fuck the God Act, fuck your roasting, fuck the Caster of Limbo, fuck this Lost Belt, fuck Bayman's King. I am killing you now! Ah, Mr. Anderson, you taught me well.
上げていこうか面倒だ水鏡の極みそういどうだもらえもらえすまん嫌だうわっ僕は導くその夢その望み届けよう全て遠き星の空へいつか僕はたどり着くセイルブルードットスイングバイするよ星の歌ゴーゴーゴー星に刻むよ悲しくないよ。
高く掲げるべならば次は勝つだけのことクロケアモーズの歯車は怖い今こそ粛清の時今こそエゴーの時我が体験は悪を断つマハープララヤ<笑>なぜつまりそなたの救いをモネこの低トラクではまだ鬼のヒーローにはなれん剣技をお見せしましょう我が手に白金の鍵あり虚無より現れ
その指先で触れたもん我が父なる神よバラの眠りを越えいざ究極の門へと至らんクリフォーは導く人の夢人の望みいただけよう全て遠き星の空へいつか僕はたどり着くセイルブルードット。忙しいんだな僕は導く人の夢人の望み届けよう全て遠き星の空へいつか僕をたどり着くセイルブルードット波の音ダブルズバッとフォールナーはっはっダイナミックダブルレイリオスクコイアーバロン
<笑>やれやれこの私に先陣を切れとはな,なんとも我の右手がうずいておるわ地獄の具現こそ僕にふさわしい風切るべきほうクローティアローかそれとも桃主典はどう思う